I wanted to share with you in the kids section some cute accessories that Elf on the Shelf could uh, purchase if uh, he wanted to. So <laughs> there's little costumes here as well if you're in a pinch for Halloween tonight. This is cute. I've never seen these squishies before. And these feel like the squishamellows. They're actually really soft. This is really well done. So they have the gold and the silver. It's not old baby. I haven't noticed these in a while. They don't belong here, but I have one in my medicine cabinet for when you need ice, like an ice pack, and they work really well. Just leave the cap open until it's completely dry after you empty out the ice so it doesn't get smelly and yucky. My son's birthday is this week. So I'm just looking to see if I can add anything else. Every time I pop into Dollar Tree, I'll add something. And it's just then at the end, I'm ready to go. These are actually very pretty. They're pearl. Nicer than the white ones we typically see. I don't know if the packaging is different, but these sparklers are new to me. I love this. I always have these at home. They're amazing. They have the biggest extreme, I don't know how to explain it, fire or s of sort, like a, it's nicer than a sparkler. And if I have any footage, I'll insert it into the video, but it's, it just makes the cake so special on your birthday with one of those on top. And um, these are newer. These banner kits, they're a really good quality, but they've been slowly selling. They've been around for a while. I like to take a look at the gift bags, and I know I sometimes miss sharing them with you because I come through here not frequently enough, but sometimes they have some really nice, elegant bags. Just simple. I don't really, I'm not a big, vibrant color, so I like to go with something a little more neutral simple uh, more timeless i guess i can't get this little bag closed well it's not a little by the way these are great gift bags as well because they're reusable and how pretty is this one actually from with olaf on it super cute great for christmas reusable bags are always nice as gift bags too lately i've been um into fabric bags and i was hoping to make some actually for christmas Tissue paper is a little bit of a hot mess here. See, these are beautiful bags. I like things like this. If any viewers out there have ideas for how to use these stickers, I use them in Happy Mail on the outside of packages. Sometimes you can frame them. These are these are a nice actual layout. Maybe menu planning or just your weekday. I'm always looking for plain journals these are lined but if you have any ideas for the wall stickers diy ideas or how to use them share them down below because somebody was asking if i had any ideas i've only ever framed them i've made like a couple art pieces i made a mer mermaid diy a few years back with it maybe i'll link that down below but if you have any ideas maybe share them all those calendars are still fully in stock Okay, I'm super excited to go down the stationery. Cute little notebooks with stickers. Like a DIY coloring book, but it's a calendar. So if you enjoy coloring and then using, having a multi use for it, I can't open it because it's sealed shut, but you get the point there on the front cover. Oh, this reminds me, I actually have to bring out, I bought a few of these kits for my daughter's friends for Halloween to go with their treats. So I better 
get that in gear, otherwise I'm going to forget. Lots of Crayola here, things that we've typically seen. Dr. Seuss Fisher Price cards, I think we've seen these as well. Some Dr. Seuss stickers. Learning activity books. Oh, these look fancy. Do we normally have these? Wow, these actually look nice. They're reusable. I might grab a couple. We have little ones in the family. Sesame Street stickers, Eric Carl, and these stickers feel so nice. They're almost like a vinyl finish. I don't know how to explain them. I haven't pulled them off the sheet yet, so I haven't tested them, but they feel like vinyl when I'm flipping through them. And we have some zebra stuff here. visiting these again just in case anyone else wants to see they have the numbers so the same one i just grabbed then they have the printing how nice are they i love that you don't have to throw away the paper and these cards i have never seen them before I know some of you love the ioni so i thought i'd share with you all the eyelashes that they have right now these are just on an end cap in the little box. There are some colored eyelashes as well. It looks like the ornaments are selling so fast because the pegs are already starting to clear out. It's crazy. Everyone kind of bypassed Halloween this year, I feel like. Or maybe not. I mean, everything is sold. Look at the pretty plates. I love the snowflake print. Which one is your favorite? Is it the plaid, the snowflake, the holly? I'm wondering what everyone is after this year. And these mugs are so cute. They have the red handle this year. So nice. I feel like a little kid, but I press the buttons. I had to share that they light up. How freaking cute are these? So you have the holly print, the plaid. I don't see plaid plates. Be on the lookout for the gel polish made by Tivoli. Oh, these are different. Um, and there were a few of you who recommended it, so I'm looking for those polishes. Sometimes there's Sephora nail polish in here as well, just a heads up. I think these are the gel ones, right? Yep, and you don't need a UV light, just in case you're wondering, you don't need the light to cure it. These are wet and wild, really pretty plum color too. Oh, they have Ioni nail embellishments. How pretty. They have some really nice nail sets as well, if you're looking. These are, I know, strawberry, but even for embellishments, for paper crafting, you can sometimes use things like this, but here's some more of those. I only sequins. I was just on my way to the checkout and this end cap caught my attention. They have some new tins that I didn't see last year. They almost have like a little luggage feel. I wish the top was different. And also new calendars out for kiddos on another end cap. For a paper crafter, you probably would think that this is a pretty good value. See, usually you pay for just one sheet at Dollar Tree and they have these kits with the cardstock and stencils. And oh, here's that vinyl. Anyways, some Christmas things on this end and then I'm truly going to the checkout. I hope you enjoyed walking through the store with me today and until next time, everyone, bye for now. And a happy birthday to all those who celebrate on Halloween.